Far away in the middle of the lonely silent jungles of the past no beyond lands, a young fiddler walker is foraging in search of food. After walking a long distance, it comes across a deep dark hole on the ground. Now entering an empty hole in the ground is always super risky for any kind of ant. There may be a deadly enemy hiding inside the hole, ready to attack the careless ants that venture too close to the hole. Or there may even be more sinister beings, an evil monster, the ant lion itself, ready to grab the unfortunate ants that fall in the hole and suck the life out of them. So the fiddle ant walker is super careful as it slowly descends down the hole. But why is this fiddle ant walker taking all these risks? It must be that the scent of something is attracting it inside the hole. Taking a great risk, the fiddle ant walker slowly climbs down the hole. But then it immediately gets out of the hole. His sister which has followed it in here also gets into the hole. But it too runs out of the hole immediately. The two fiddle ant sisters pass on some phenomenal message to one another as if planning something and then both of them leave the place and runs quickly towards their nest. As they enter the nest, their phenomenal message quickly spreads throughout the colony and the fiddle ant army quickly gets into action and leave the nest. The two Fedele ancestors lead the way and the Fedele army consisting of a big-headed Fedele major quickly follows them. Reaching the whole site, the Fedele walkers immediately starts to widen the entrance of the hole. But it is strange that instead of getting inside the hole, the Fedele walkers are desperately widening the entrance of the hole. But the purpose of widening of the entrance of the hole by the Fedele walkers is soon clear. They are widening the hole so that their big-headed major can get inside. And when the weak-headed fatal major comes out of the hole, it brings along with it this beautiful black queen ant. Some of the excited fatal walkers quickly take hold of the poor black queen ant, whose gaster has been severely damaged by the fatal major. While the rest of the fatal walkers still continue to dig into the hole, perhaps in search of the eggs of the black queen. This black queen has no walkers of her own to defend her. So it must be that she is a newly mated queen who had just hidden herself under the sandy soil after mating during the recent nuptial flight. Sadly, this black queen ant will now never be able to form a colony of her own. The energetic fiddle walkers quickly start to carry the almost dead black queen ant towards their nest, happy to have found this nutritious source of protein for their own queen. Now like everyone else, you must be thinking, what if the black queen ant had her own walkers? Would the black ant walkers have been able to defend their queen against the fiddle army? Well, to know the answer to this question, we must find out to which ant kingdom do this black queen ant actually belong to. The ant watcher has seen black queen ants like this before. The unfortunate black queen ant was actually a queen ant belonging to the Lepisiota Rotnei clan and the members of this clan look very similar to the Crematogaster ants due to similarity in the shape of their gasters with that of the Crematogaster ants. And these Lepisiota ants are quite capable hunters who can hunt down even the big size preys. And these Lepisiota ants may be the only Lepisiota species with the presence of big sized major in their colony. And these ants are quite aggressive and capable of killing and eating other ants and well that also includes the Fedole ants. So as far as the question of these ants being able to defend their queen against the fiddle ants is concerned, the answer lies in the fact that these ants can even give the super aggressive yellow crazy ants a run for their money. In short, with the Lepisiota walkers around, the Fedele army would have never dared to attack the Black Queen ants. So as far as the question of whether these Lepisiota ants would have been able to defend their queen against the Fedele army is concerned, the answer is yes, without any doubt or big yes. <laughs>